Hey, this is Brian Stillman with uh, Be Terrific, BeTerrific.com. We're at CES 2020 here in Las Vegas, Nevada. I am here with CarePredict. CarePredict is a wearable for seniors that uses AI to predict pattern changes and lifestyle changes. Tell me a little bit about this. That's right, Brian. It's been well known for a very long time that there are changes in activities and behaviors before there's a decline in health. In the past, we used to rely on human observation to catch those activity behavior changes. You know, we all live closer together. We could see that mom has her hair unbrushed, she's still in pajamas at three in the afternoon, she's staying away from uh, bright lights and sunlight. Those we knew intuitively were the signs that she was going into depression. But now we're all living apart, much farther apart sometimes. And you need something to replace that human observation. And that's what we do at CarePredict. We created the world's first wearables for seniors specifically to track activity and behavior patterns. It goes on the wrist of the dominant arm, it tracks all the gestures that the individual is doing. Are they eating, drinking, bathing, sleeping, cooking, all of that. It also knows where they are in the home. It takes all that information, uses machine learning and AI to create a baseline pattern of an individual's activities and behaviors, and then looks for a deviation that it signifies that something is going wrong. What does it do with that information? So it, it, when it identifies that there's a change in behavior, what happens? So when it detects a change, let's say it detects a change that mom skipped two meals today, it immediately sends an alert to the care circle. The care circle consists of all the people concerned about mom. Could be the neighbor, could be siblings, sons, daughters, they all get the message. And within the mobile app, they can actually communicate with each other and, and try and figure out who's helping mom, who's doing what. It completely brings all that care coordination into one single location. Is there a way for, uh, does this tie in at all with medical facilities, with um, whoever, maybe a hospice care, whoever might be there overseeing the, uh, the parent or whoever it might be? Absolutely. So today we are deployed in home care in the U.S. Home care, not home health care. So these are the big franchisers in the industry that are deploying our product into their client's home. What they are finding out is that the family wants them to handle all the responses to every alert because the family cannot take time off from work or do whatever it needs to do to respond to mom at that moment of need. They are having the home care agency be the preferred partner that can respond, find out why did mom skip two meals today? Is it because she had no groceries so they can actually go take mom out to get groceries? Or is it because mom is not feeling well and so they can actually go do a meal preparation for her? And they can charge additional monies for all of that. Family is happy to allow that because it means that they are insulated from the day-to-day -day responses needed to take care of an aging loved one. Now, is this something that is a subscription-based service, or have you just created the tech that other companies are then uh, integrating into their care provide uh, the way they provide care? How does this work? Right. So today we are a product that costs an upfront fee to buy, and then there's a subscription for the monitoring and the AI and all of that. When we resell through home care agencies, they are, pro they are providing additional service on top for that subscription amount. They're responding to mom, they're calling mom, they're visiting mom for all of that. So, so it's aligned with into all of their systems and it's integrated into them. Our next step would be to go to the Medicare Advantage plans who are all looking to see how they could get a, a better handle on the cost of senior care in this country. You know, it's like 7% of all the seniors account for 60% of all the Medicare dollars spent. And they want to go after that and try and figure out if they can catch a decline before it occurs so they can bend the cost curve. So if people want to learn more about this, if they want to investigate the product for themselves, where can they go? They can go to www.carepredict.com and you can look at all the product information, testimonials, as well as purchase the product there as of today. What does the product sell for? $449. And what sort of subscription fee is there if they're going through you, not through their healthcare provider, which might have their own system? Right. Our subscription fee is $69 a month. Right. Yeah. And when... So where, where are you based in... So how are you trying to figure out... This is edited, so I'm trying to figure out this question. So they sign up for your subscription. And where is all this information being sent to and then analyzed and, and then uh, you contact the families? Where is all that taking place? Right. So the device collects all the information and every time there's a change of location or movement, it sends it via Wi-Fi to the back end, which is an Amazon cloud. 
That's where all the deep learning AI systems are. They're looking at all the data and figuring out when is it time to alert the care circle. And the care circle receives all these alerts on their apps or via email or text. So what, what prompted the creation of this? You know, it's, <laughs> you said before, we all used to live together, now we're further apart. Um, what, what, what sparked that first idea? Well, I created this company out of a necessity. My dad is this year 93 and my mom's 83. They live 10 minutes away from me and I talk to them every day. But when I show up in person on that Saturday, I find completely new things that I was not aware of. More often than not, that new thing made me take them either to the ER or pretty much mess up the rest of my work schedule for the following week to get them office appointments with physicians. Their, the unpredictability in their health was causing unpredictability in my life. And I'm the classic sandwich generation. I have three young children and two very old parents to take care of. And I was being stretched too far apart. I needed something that would help me understand what was going to be happening with them so I could have some chance of planning ahead. Great, this is a really great product, really helpful. I think a lot of people are going to be uh, appreciative of the ability to take advantage of that, that notice, you know, forewarning you yeah. of incidents before they take place. Stick around, we're going to have a lot more coverage for you. This is Brian Stillman with Be Terrific, BeTerrific.com. We're here at CES 2020. We'll be back.